hello everyone uh, today I am making this video uh, to when persons are usually automating their mobiles there are broadly two main frameworks available the one is APM and the other is Selenoid and it is uh, very confusion in what framework we use for automating our mobile apps so I just wanted to make it clear it is not about which tool we are using it is about what we are testing just let me show you if we go to uh, let's see oh, my computer just uh, yeah uh, I go to Android API and uh, Wikipedia okay this is the first link by the Wikipedia yeah so it has the history of the Android versions see here the Android version started from 1.0 then 1.1 1.5 so for every version that is released there is in a set of API's which are associated this like the Android one starts with the API level 1 now if we go here the Android 2 has API level of 5 the next version was 2.0.1 and the API level was 6 so with every version the API level increases and the current version for the Android is 5.1 which is also called lollipop and which has the API level 22 and it is the latest in the market so to make sure which framework we want to use for automation depends upon this API level now let me just show you here uh, like yeah let me just show you here only so if you want the selenoid st start testing from API level 4 till API level 19 right and the APM starts from API level 17 right so if we so if we want to test on the mobile phones which are having the API level 17 maybe the handsets which are one year old and in which the manufacturer does not allow to upgrade your api level and if you want to cover those android sets as well which have api level below 17 that cannot be automated through apm so we in that case we need the help of the selenoid test these APIs level right so the main difference comes here this is the boundary the API 17 below the low versions can only be tested on Selenoid and the upper versions 17 and the upper versions can only be tested by APM plus Selenoid as well but API uh, level 22 is supported with APM but Selenoid does not let us just check also on their website what is the current API level which is supported through Selenoid let me check I see LA Selenoid yeah Selenoid let's go to their website yeah this is the first link loading mm, yes this is the one multiple Android target API support 10 to 18 now back here 
so it is supporting from here till here that is below 17 as well above 17 but only till APL level 90 but on the other hand if I go uh, APM API level okay so this go to this link so it will be the doc open which is given by the APM guys and uh, yes it is saying so if you want to use Android 4.2 plus that is above APL level 17 then you can use the APM and they have also mentioned if you want to use below this right if you want to automate below this till 2.3 you have to use Selenroid right so it is not about which framework is best it is the re your requirements what you need to test like if you want to test API level 21 20 it cannot be tested through Selenroid right so I think uh, but as per the market APM is a very good tool uh, it is on a boom the features provided them it's superb I think the future will be the APM definitely yeah that's all and my next videos will be uh, it's just the starting the next videos will be covering a lot about the APM thank you